Word of Truth broadcast, brought to you by the Church of our Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostles and Prophet Faith, where John Aaron Butler is pastor. We are located at 4952 on St. Augustine Road, Tallahassee, Florida, 32311. chapter of Psalms, beginning at verse 20. For they speak not peace, but they devise deceitful manner against them that are quiet in the land. Yes, they open their mouth wide against me and say, Aha, aha, our eyes have seen it. This you have seen, O Lord, keep not silent. O Lord, be not far from me. Stir up yourselves and awake to judgment, even unto my cause, my God and my Lord. Judge me, O Lord, my God, according to your righteousness, and let them not rejoice over me. Let them not say in their heart, Aha, so we so would we have it. Let them not say we have swallowed him up. Let them be ashamed and brought to confusion together that rejoice at my hurt. Let them be clothed with shame and dishonor that magnify themselves against me. Let them shout for joy and be glad that favor my righteous cause. Yes, let them say continually, 
let the Lord be magnified, yes. which has pleasure yes. in the prosperity of his servant. Yes. And my tongue shall speak of your righteousness and of your praise all the day long. You may take your seat. 20th verse to the 20th verse of the 35th chapter of Psalm. May the Lord bless the hearers reading of the word. Someone call a song, please. Oh, magnify the Lord. Oh, magnify the Lord. salvation, giving me a mind to want to do those things which are right and pleasing in the sight of the Lord. Thank God for my water baptism. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank God for the gift of the Holy Ghost, speaking out of the tongue as the Spirit of God give our action each and every one to pray my continuous in the Lord. Now the house is open to those that may have a song or pray for this time. I love you. I love you. Holding my peace and really letting the Lord fight my battle because 
the message that came forth on Tuesday was really encouragement for me because I thought what I was going through at my job was something so tremendous or humongous for me, but listening to the scriptures and listening to what Joel went through when he was in his text, his trials that he went through, my new
fell short. Sometimes I felt slipped, fell, and I almost feel like I didn't even want to get back up. But I just thank and praise God that the strength that he gave me, because it was none of my strength that allowed me to get back up. It was only his grace and his mercy and his love. And that for one reason, I have to continue to praise him for the rest of my days. And I I just want to give him thank thanks. You, I may Jesus. not be feeling the best all the way, but just when I thank you, hallelujah, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, his goodness, hallelujah, and all that he's done for me, saints, I truly have a praise in my own self, and I thank you, I thank him so much, I thank God for the Holy Ghost, the evidence of speaking in tongues that the Spirit of God gives utterance, thank you, praise God for my husband and my children, my natural family, my spiritual family, I continue to pray my strength in the Lord, that I be really in the last dark and evil days. I thank God for the precious gift of the Holy Ghost speaking with other tongues and the Spirit of God give utterance. I truly thank God for just another day I I never seen before that He has allowed me to see. Just thank God for being a God of you know patience, a God of mercy, a God of faith, a God of love. And I just truly thank God for His Son Jesus Christ. I just thank God for um, not giving up on me and just changing my life, changing my ways, changing my my thoughts. You know. When I was down to prayer on the Lord, it's like just showing me like, like how much, you know, he has kept us and just kept me. You know, sometimes we think we're going to fall asleep, but the Lord has put a, a hedge about us, a hedge of protection around us. And when we feel like we're going to go over, he, you know, he's right there to pull us back in. So I truly thank God for Jesus Christ. I thank God for his shedding of his precious blood. Thank God for him giving himself as a sacrifice, a holy sacrifice. You know, it's that great high priest that standeth before God forever. And I just truly thank God for, you know, all the blessings he's done in my life. I thank God for how on uh, Tuesday or Monday, um, or Wednesday, I'm um, sorry, how, you know, I was praying to God. You know, I was praying. I said, Lord, I need, you know, I, I've been praying and asking for you. I want things to change in my life. You know, you know what I desire as far as the job. Then less than five minutes later, saints, you know, I got a telephone call and a, and a, um, it was a job saying, can you come in for an interview next week? And I just truly thank God for, you know, somebody look at us as far as I'm going to ask my prayer. You know, my God, ask my prayer. And everything I ask for, I will receive in Jesus Christ's name. Come to repentance. Come to the realization in life that you have to repent. What is repentance? Repenting is becoming godly sorry for all the sins you have committed, those that you are aware of, there may be some that you are not aware of, but nevertheless, the Lord wants man to repent. And then after man repent, he wants to be baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen, sir. For the remission of their sin so that they can live holy. So we thank God for the word of God, the information that God has allowed us to be able to disperse and to give to men, women, boys, and girls if they want to be saved. So we thank God for all things. Get Luke 24, 24th chapter of Luke. Amen. Luke, the 24th chapter, beginning in verse 35. Let's hear what the word says. And they told what things were done in the way. Uh-huh. And how he was known of them and breaking of bread. Well, here's the Lord that came on back now. Amen. He was dead for three days and three nights as 
Jonah was in the belly of the whale Amen. three days and three nights. So was the Son of Man in the heart of the earth. Amen. Three days and three nights. Yes, sir. <clears throat> All right. And as they spake, Jesus himself stood in the midst of them. As they spake, Jesus himself. He stood in the midst of them. And said unto them. What? Peace be unto you. Well, he wants us to have peace. Yes, sir. He wants his people, all of God's people should have peace. Amen. But it's sometimes there's so much turmoil and so many things going on until people don't have the peace that they should have within themselves. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. But what did he say? But they were terrified and frightened. And supposed that they had seen a spirit. And they supposed that they had seen a spirit. They was terrified and affrighted. Go and ahead. And he said unto them. What he said. Why are ye troubled? Why are ye troubled? And why do thoughts arise in your hearts? Uh-huh. Behold my hands and my feet. Well, it was him. Amen. It was him. Yes, sir. He's not in the grave. No, sir. He has risen. Oh, you go. Yeah. As he said. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. He died and shed his blood that we may have a chance to be saved. Thank you, Lord Jesus. If we desire to. Amen. But it's something that we got to do. To go. Is that right? Yes, sir. You got to repent. Yes, sir. You can't continue. One scripture says, should we, should we continue in sin? I believe it's Romans. Is that right? Amen. What do you say in Romans over there? Amen. Romans, the sixth chapter. Romans, the sixth one. chapter, verse one says, What shall we say then? What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that you grace may abound? You mean to tell me you hear Christ and died for our sins, made it possible that we can repent of our sins and be forgiven? And he asked, the question was asked, should we continue in sin? That grace may abound. I mean, that go for the people of God, the people of yes, God sir. that... You know, we, we both strive to be holy. not living in sin. We want to be holy like Amen. God. Yes, sir. Is that right? Yes, sir. Amen. We want to be holy like the Lord said, not doing all kinds of things. And there yeah, may be a time you might fall short. Amen. But then you get up. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. Repent of your sin. Is that right? Amen. Because that's one of the great benefits we have. Thank you, Lord Jesus. All right, what he says? Amen. Shall we continue in sin? Should we continue in sin? That grace may abound. That grace may abound. God forbid. No, he don't want you to continue in sin. Amen. Go ahead. How shall we that are dead to sin live any longer? Well, the people end? of God, we're supposed to be striving to die to sin. Die daily, sir. Got to die to sin. Amen. We can't, we can't be enjoying sin. No, sir. All the unright all unrighteousness is sin. Yes, sir. You know, fornicating, lying, stealing. All kind of things that people do. Amen. Amen. Right? Yes, sir. Amen. That's just some of the things. Amen. But there are many things that men, women, boys, and girls are doing that they need to repent of. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. Because it's not God will let you perish. Amen. But you need to come to repentance. <clears throat> yes, sir. Come to the point and saying, I need God in my life. I God. need to stop doing all this. Yes. Is that right? Yes, sir. Amen. Go ahead. Amen. How shall we that are dead to sin live? How shall we that are dead to sin live any longer therein? Live any longer. You mean tell me you're dead to sin? You don't want to be living no, any sir. longer in sin. No, sir. Is that right? Amen. Amen. We're going to be striving to do what the Lord say. Hallelujah. What are you saying, my beloved? Yes, sir. Know ye not know that ye so not? many of us as were baptized into Jesus Christ were baptized into his death? Baptized. See, when you're baptized, you repent. Yes, sir. You went down in, in the water of the grave. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. You were baptized unto death. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. You consenting to die from what? Everything that's not like him. Everything in the world. Is that right? Amen. Everything that's not like God, you, you will, should we both be willing to die from? Is Amen. that right? Yes, sir. Just as he died. Amen. Is that right? Go ahead. Yes, sir. Therefore, we are buried with him by baptism into death. We are buried with him into baptism of the dead. Go ahead. That like as Christ was raised up from the dead. Now, the like as God, Christ yes, was sir. raised from the dead. By the glory. He was raised from the dead. Yes, sir. 
by the glory of the Father. Amen. Is that right? He was raised, so he's not still in no grave. He's no, risen, as he said. Amen. Romans 8 and 11. What it said. But if the spirit of him that raised up Jesus from the dead dwell in you. Now, what should happen? He that raised up Christ from the dead shall also quicken your mortal body. Now, it's spirit, but, but it's a key Lord. thing he said. Amen. If the spirit. Yes, sir. The same right. spirit, sir. Is that right? The same spirit. If the spirit. Amen. That raised up Christ from the dead. Yes, sir. See, that's the spirit that everybody got to receive. Amen. You got to receive of the spirit that Jesus the the had. Yes, sir. Is that right? Yes, sir. What's that? The Holy Ghost. Amen. The Holy Spirit. Yes, sir. The one that God told them that they should receive when they go back to Jerusalem. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. Wait for the promise of the Father. Yes, sir. Say if he for John yeah, heard of me what he says. Amen. Acts to the first chapter, begin at verse five. What it said? Begin at verse four. Listen. But wait for the promise of the Father. Well, he said, wait for the promise of the Father. If that spirit yes, sir. that raised up Jesus Amen. dwell in you. Amen. You got to make sure that you got the same see the same spirit Jesus said. Yes, sir. You can't have no other spirit now. No, sir. Is that right? Yes, sir. Amen. 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 And it's gonna come. It's gonna be like the Word of God said. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. All these people, these different spirits, saying they got the Holy Ghost, they got God in their life, and everything, and they're doing some of everything that they want us to continue to do. Amen. Should we continue in sin? Like grace may abound. God forbid. That's why you got to repent. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. What he said? Amen. Wait for the promise of the Father. He said, "Wait for the promise of the Father." Which said he? Wait for the promise of the Father. Which says he? He hath heard of me. You have heard of me. For John truly baptized with water. John he truly baptized yes, sir. with water. But ye shall be baptized with the Holy Ghost not many days hence. Now that's what we're talking yes, about. Yes, sir. You got to be baptized with the Holy with Ghost. With the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You got to be baptized with the Holy Ghost. Amen. John truly baptized with water. Amen. We're talking about the Holy Ghost now. Yes, sir. Being filled. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. Being filled with the Spirit of God. I, yes, sir. Go ahead, my beloved. Amen. But you should be baptized with the Holy Ghost not many days hence. Not many days hence. When they therefore would come together, they ask of him. What? Saying, Lord. Lord. Will thou at this time restore again the kingdom to Israel? What he said. He said unto them. It is not for you to know the times of the season. It's not for you to know the times or the season. Which the Father hath put in his own power. Yes. But ye shall receive power. When? After that the Holy Ghost has come upon you. Well, if you get the Holy Ghost, you're going to have power. Thank you for the power, Lord yeah. Jesus. They're going to be doing some old, thing, old things. No, you get, sir. You get enough power to resist things now. Yes, sir. Yeah. Is that right? Amen. Man, I ain't got enough power. You got enough. You got enough. You get the Holy Ghost, he going to give you power. Yes, sir. You'll receive the power. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. I can't help you. Yes, you can. You yes, you can. You need the Holy Ghost. You got to have a mind and desire to resist. Yes, sir. And to do what the Lord say do. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. Go ahead. Amen. But ye shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost is come upon you. He said he shall receive power after the Holy Ghost has come upon you. And ye shall be witnesses unto me in what? Jerusalem. Jerusalem. And in all Judea. All Judea. And in Samaria. Uh-huh. And unto the uttermost parts of the earth. Yes. And when he had spoken these things, what he did? while they beheld, he was taken up, and a cloud received him out of their sight. And he told them what to do then. Amen. What else he said? Amen. And while they looked up steadfast, steadfastly towards heaven, uh -huh. as he went up, behold, two men stood by them in white apparel. And? Which also said, ye men of Galilee, mm -hmm. why standing ye gazing up into heaven? Why ye stand gazing up into heaven? This same Jesus, which is taken up from you into heaven, shall so come in like manner as ye have seen him go. Well, he's coming heaven. back. Yes, sir. According to the scripture, he's coming back. Amen. Is that right? Amen. And you better be ready for his return. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. He ain't going to let nobody know. No, sir. But he do want man to repent. The day of the Lord. Is that right? Well, man, to repent of their sin. Stop sinning. Strive to want to do what God said to do. We, one scripture says, straight is the gate and now is the way. One thing about it, it's not going to be very many people saved. No, sir. Amen. It's not going to be very many people saved. Because they don't want to give up things that they love doing in the flesh. Amen. 
See, in order to live for the Lord, you got to give up things that you love doing in the flesh. That's true, sir. Because God is a spirit. Those God don't want you to continue to once you say, sure, you continue to see that grace may abound. God forbid. You know what I'm saying? God forbid. You, you just can't. It's things you got to stop. Yes, sir. And that's the problem with people. They don't want to stop doing the certain things they enjoy doing in the flesh. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. But he's coming back again. Amen. That's why he said, and that repentance and remission of sin. Yeah. Should be preached. Amen. Back over in Luke. That's preached. Chapter. Just like when the days of Noah was. Amen. Noah preached the gospel, uh -huh. telling people to come on and knock. Yes, sir. He said, it's going to rain. Yes, sir. But they didn't believe no, Noah. Sir. Noah preached 120 years. And people still didn't want to stop. That's Amen. what the scripture say. As it were in the days of Noah. So shall He said, so shall. Yeah, it right. also be the in the days. days of the Son of Man. Amen. For in the days that were before the flood, they were doing something. Eating. Is that right? Amen. People, they were eating. Yeah. They were drinking. They were marrying. They were giving in marriage. Amen. Until the day that Noah entered into the ark. Mm. Now, what are people going to be doing? They're going to be doing everything they want to do. Married, giving in marriage, doing what they want to do, partying, smoking, smoking joints, getting high, shooting up. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Amen. Strip clubs and all these people gonna be doing everything they want to do. Amen. 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 Everything. He just he mentioned something, but people are doing way more now. Amen. They eating, they drinking, they married, giving in marriage, they marrying the wrong sex. Amen. Male and female. What is that right? Male and male, yeah, female yeah. and female, Amen. all kinds of marriage and adultery, all fornication, doing everything. Yeah. Amen. Is that and feel good in the flesh about doing it? Lord Jesus, stop us all. Is that right? Amen. But God is coming back. Everybody say, repent. Amen. Turn away from that. Come to the acknowledgement that you need the Lord in your life. Amen. What are you saying? And back over in Luke the twenty fourth chapter, sir. Let's hear it. Amen. At, what was that verse? 40. Let's hear it. And when he had thus spoken, he showed them his hands and his feet. He showed them his hands and his feet. And while they yet believed not for joy. While they yet believed not for joy. And wondered. And wondered. He said unto them, What? Have you here any meat? Do you have any meat yet? And they gave him a piece of broiled fish. They gave him a piece of broiled fish. And of a honeycomb. And of a honeycomb. And he took it. He took it. And did eat before them. He did eat before them. And he said unto them, What? These are the words which I spake unto you see, while here, I was with you. See, here's the, here is the Son of God proving, proving himself. himself to his disciples. Amen. I told you this was going to happen. That when it happened, you could be aware of it. Amen. What did he say? These are the words which I spake unto you. These are the words that I spake unto you while I was with, while I was yet with you. While I was yet with you. That all things must be fulfilled. All things must be fulfilled. Which were written in the law of Moses. Which was written in the law of Moses. In the prophets. And in the prophets. In the Psalms. In the Psalms. Concerning me. Everything they talked about Jesus. Yes, right? sir. Everything that the prophets talked about him. They talked about him in the song. Is that right? Amen. Everything they talked about. Amen. They talked about Jesus. Even when Isaiah said, Unto us a child is born. Hallelujah. Unto us a son, son is given. Government Amen. shall be upon his shoulder. Amen. Name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of peace. Yes, Amen. sir. Amen. All these things they talked about. Amen. What else it says here? Amen, sir. They op then open he their understanding. Then open he their understanding. That they might understand the scripture. Oh, now he opened Jesus opened their understanding that they might understand the scripture. Amen. And did what? And said unto them, What? Thus it is written. Thus, you got to listen. We got to believe what's what? Written. What's written. Uh, you believe on me. We got to believe what's written. Amen. Gave open their understanding. Said, and what else? They don't be understanding. Amen. That they might understand the that scripture. They might understand the scripture. And he said unto them, Yes. Thus it is written. Thus it's written. And thus it behoved Christ to suffer. It behoved Christ to suffer. And to rise from the dead the third day. And to rise from the dead the third day. Amen. And that repentance. 
All right. Amen. And that repentance and remissions of sins should be preached in his name among all nations. Everybody got to repent. Beginning at Jerusalem. Everybody got to repent. Amen. Everybody got to be baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ because neither is there salvation in the other. Amen. There is none other name given under the heavens among men whereby we must be saved. Amen. Amen. Is that right? Yes, sir. Jesus is the Lamb. Yes, sir. Is that right? Jesus is the door. Thank you, Lord. He's the one that has made it possible for us to be able to enter in. Hallelujah. Is that right? The door to heaven. Amen. Amen. Every man got to come through that door. Yes, sir. Amen. Is that right? And then he said, if you come in any other way, you're like a thief and a robber. But he wants everybody to repent. Amen. What he said is that, that, repent that repentance and remission of sins repent. should be preached. More people to repent. Remember, Jesus died for our sins to be remitted. Yes, sir, indeed, sir. For our sins to be forgiven. Amen. He shed the blood. We have a Lord chance Jesus. now. Yes, sir. We don't have to live. What's going to say? Should we continue in sin? And grace. That grace be about God for me. Hallelujah, God. Is that right? So it's possible now we we can be forgiven. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We can repent of our sins. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Live right. Yes, sir. In this evil world that we live in. Yes, sir. Is that amen? That's what he wants to do. Hallelujah, God. What else he says here? Yes, sir. That repentance and remission of sins should be preached in His name among all nations. Among what? Among all nations. Among what? All nations. That repentance and remission of sin should be preached, should be preached in his name among. What Isaiah say? Amen. Second chapter of Isaiah, I believe, yeah. verse 9. Yeah. Amen. Let's see what he yeah. say. Yeah, amen. That's brief. Second chapter of Isaiah, uh -huh. beginning at verse 1. What it said? The word that Isaiah, the son of Amos, saw concerning the Jews. Remember Jude. now he said that repentance and remission of sin. Amen. Should be preached in his name among who? All nations. All nations. Beginning in Jerusalem. All nations. We may have to go, we may have to walk over in Jerusalem where you, you see all kinds of different ethnic groups that was at Jerusalem on the Yes, sir. Huh? It was about Jews. It was about Jews out of what do you say? Every, Every nation. nation. Amen. Every nation under the sun. Amen. Is that right? The Jews got to do it. Amen. I don't care what you are to the Parthians. Parthians. What do you say here? Amen. Acts the second yeah. chapter. What do they say? Read verse, verse 7. We just want to touch it a little bit. Verse 9. Then. Let's hear it. Parthians, Emidas, Elamites. Go, go on up there, little, little Amen, fellow over there. Yes, fine. sir. What do you say? We're going to have verse 5. Let's hear it. And they were dwelling at Jerusalem. They were dwelling at Jerusalem. Jews. Jews. Devoted men. Devoted men. Out of every nation under heaven. Mm. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. You see who was at Jerusalem? Every man. Huh? Every nation under the sun. Amen. And what did he say over in Isaiah? Amen, sir. Hallelujah. That the Amen. word that Isaiah, the son of Amos, saw concerning Judea and Jerusalem. Now here's the prophet talk. Amen. Listen what the prophet said. Go ahead. And it shall come to pass in the last days. Yes. That the mountain of the Lord house shall be established. Mountain of the Lord's house. Yes, sir. Glory to God. Yes, sir. Shall be established in the top of the mountains. In the top of the mountains. And shall be established. Yes, one thing about it. It will be established. Yes, sir. In the top of the mountain. Now, that's wrong. It's high. Yes, sir. Above everything. Yes, sir. So high, you can't go over. Yes, sir. It's so wide. Can't go you can't go around. It's so deep. And it's so deep. You can't go up. You must go with it. You got to come through the door. Yes, sir. That's why Jesus in the hole. Uh -huh. I stand at the door and knock. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Didn't he say it? He sir? said it, sir. What did he say over there, my love? And it shall come to pass in the last days. Yes, sir. That the mountain of the Lord's house shall be mountain established. Mountain of the Lord's house shall be established. In the top of the mountain. In the top of the mountain. And it shall be exalted. Glory to God. All the right. It's going to be exalted above the hills. And all nations shall flow unto it. How many nations? All nations shall flow unto it. How many nations? All nations shall flow unto it. Devil dwelling at Jerusalem. Amen. Yes, sir. They were dwelling at Jerusalem. Yes, sir. What was there? Amen. Is there Parthenites? Yes, sir. Jews. Yes. Amen. They found men out of what? Out of where? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Under the heavens. Hallelujah. 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 Huh? Yes, sir. 
This thing was talked about in the days of the prophet, you understand? Yes, sir. Isaiah prophesied about it. Oh, yes, he did. That's why he said all things must be fulfilled. Yes. Which was red time. You know, all those that in the prophets concerning me. Yes, yes he said so. He said, open, he that understand it, that they, that they might understand. understand the scripture. Yes, sir. That's right. Amen. But he said there will be all nations. Yes, sir. Everybody in the world got to repent. Yes, sir. Is that right? He died and shed his blood. Thank you, Jesus. For everybody. Thank you, Jesus. You understand? He came down to fight to his own. Yes, sir. Is that right? Yes. What is yes. the Lamb of God? Oh, Lord, he didn't yes. say yes. God. Is that right? Yes, sir. Amen. 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 John yes. saw him come and John said, Behold, the Lamb of God was taken away. The sins. The sins of who? The world. The next day, John saw Jesus. The next day, John saw Jesus coming unto him. Coming unto him. And saying, Saying, What? Behold. I want you to look at something. The Lamb of God. The Lamb of who? The Lamb of God. The Lamb of God. For John. The Lamb of God. Which take it? Which do what? Which take it? Which do what? Which take it away? What? The sins of the world. All nations shall flow into it. Yes, sir. It shall come to pass. Lord, 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 Lord. That the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established from the top of the And it shall be exalted above the It shall be exalted above the And all nations of all nations got to flow under what? It. Yes, sir. Lord, yes, sir. It ain't no one. Yes, sir. That's it. Yes, sir. He is it. Yes, sir. Jesus is it. Hallelujah, Lord. Is that right? Yes, sir. He died, shed his blood, that all nations under the heaven shall flow, shall flow unto it. Amen. Is that right? Many people shall go and say, Come ye. And let us go up to the mountain of the Lord. Let's go to the mountain of the Lord. To the house. Of the God of Jacob. The God of Jacob. And he will teach us of his ways. You want to think about it. We got to be taught the ways of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Is that right? Don't you never think that you know the ways of God. You got to be taught the ways of God. Amen. Didn't he do so? Yes, sir. Huh? You got to be taught the ways of God. Yes, sir. It ain't that we know his way. We got to be taught the ways of God. Yes, sir. And then when we're taught the ways of God, we want to walk in the ways of God. Hallelujah. Huh? We got to be taught what God says. Lord, Lord, Lord. Amen. Yes, sir. Didn't he say so? He said it, sir. What else he says here? Amen. Come, and, come ye, let us go up to the mountain of Let's the Lord. Let's go to the mountain of the Lord. To the house of the God of Jesus. To Jacob. the house of the God of Jesus. And he will teach us of his ways. He's going to teach us of his ways. And we will walk in his path. And we will walk in his path. For out of Zion shall go forth the law. Out of Zion shall Hallelujah. go forth the law. And the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. Got to go back to Jerusalem. Wait for the promise. Did you say so? Wait for the promise. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Yeah. Lord! But the word from Jerusalem. Yes, sir. Is that right? Mm. Amen. What did he say over there in Jerusalem? There were Jews devout men out of every nation. Amen. Acts the second chapter. Yes, sir. Verse five. Let's hear. And they, were they were dwelling at Jerusalem. They were dwelling at Jerusalem. Jews. The law was men. given by Moses. Yes, sir. But grace and truth yes. came through Jesus yes. Christ. Through Jesus Christ. Yes. Grace and truth. Yes. Grace and truth. Grace and truth. Yes, sir. Can you hallelujah to God to Almighty? Hallelujah. Came through Jesus Christ. But the law was given the by Lamb, Moses. The Lamb of God. Yes, sir. The one that Isaiah said, unto us a child is born. A son is given. Son is given. God and God shall be upon his, his shoulders. His name shall be called. Wonderful. Wonderful. Counselor, the mighty God, the everlasting Father, the Prince of the Prince yeah. of Peace, well, the of and the of, the of the increase of His government and peace, there shall be what? No end. Thank you, Jesus. No end. And upon the throne of David. Uh, upon the throne of David. Thank Amen. You. Upon His kingdom. And upon His kingdom. To order it. To, you know they talked about it. Yes. Sir. Even over, even over in Acts, where they talked about how that He would take. Jesus, you understand? And they sit him on the throne of David. Hallelujah. Is that right? Amen. Talking about that natural part and how that God, even David said, he foresaw the Lord always did. Amen. 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 Yes, All sir. right. Amen. Go ahead, my beloved. Amen. Amen. Two, verse five. Yes, two, four, and five. We'll work on down there. Amen, Amen, sir. And there was the willing at Jerusalem. Willing at Jerusalem, Jew. Devoted men. Devoted men. Out of every nation under heaven. Didn't Isaiah say that? Amen. 
He said it. Devout so. men out of every nation. Under heaven. Under heaven. Now with this noise. When this was noise abroad. The multitude came together. The multitude came together. And were confounded. They were confounded. Because that every man heard them speak in they, his own they language. Heard, they heard them speak. Everybody said, you got to have the Holy Spirit. Yes, sir, indeed. And you go speak in tongue as the Spirit. As the Spirit. Yes, sir. As the Spirit. And they, they were all filled with the Holy Ghost. I ain't talking about Shemosha or Hapu. And began to speak with other tongues like the Spirit gave them. I ain't talking about Shemosha or Hapu. No, sir. I'm talking with that spirit. You're going to speak another language. Yes, sir. Let me see there were Jews about men out of every nation. And the people that, that was there, they heard them heard them speaking. They said, how did we hear every man speaking in our own tongue wherein we were born? Is that right? Is that what they said? This is the wonderful words. Are not all of these got lived, but God was working a work through through them people. Yes, sir. And prove something to the others that was standing by. Yes, sir. God can work works, can he? Yes, he can. What did he say here? Amen. The multitude came together. They came together. And were confounded because that every man heard them speak in his own language. Heard speaking speak in his own language. And they were all amazed. They were all amazed. And marveled. They were all amazed and marveled. Saying one to another. Saying one to, see, they, see, no, they, they, they heard them. Mm. Ain't that they understood them. But they heard them. Amen. That, that's how it lay. They understood. They heard. Him. Amen. But they were all amazed and wondered. Why? Amen. Behold, are not all these? Are not all these which speak? Which speak Galileans? Let me tell all these people. These, these are these are one nation of people. All these are Galileans. Yes, sir. All of these are Galileans. Yes, sir. Now listen to what Scripture says. And how, and how here, how here, we every man in our own tongue. We hear every man in our own tongue. Where we're, and where, wherein we were born. Ain't God good? Yes. God can do some marvelous things. He confounded the language, he can open up. He, right. he confounded, That's he right. opened up, and they, they hear him speaking. Yeah. But all, he's like saying, are not all these here, this kind of people? How is it that we hear him, they hear they, he got all these other Groups of people and they hear speaking in tongues. Is that all right? Go ahead. Amen. How we hear every man in our own in our own tongue, where we were born, Parthians, Parthians. Medes, Medes, Elamites, Elamites, the dwellers in Mesopotamia, dwellers in Mesopotamia, and Judea, Judea, Cappadocia, yes, and Pontius, Pontius, in Asia, yes, and and Pharbia, yeah, and Pamphylia, in Egypt, hear all these people. Amen. Go ahead. And in the parts of Libya, Libya, and Serene, yeah. and strangers of Rome, strangers of Rome, Jews, Jews, proselytes, proselytes, Greeks in Arabia, Greeks in Arabia. Hear that? Amen. Go to God. We do hear them. Speak. We do hear them speak in our own tongue. We hear them people speaking in our own tongue. When this was Lord bro, we hear them speaking in our own tongue. The wonderful works of God. It was what? The wonderful works of God. Huh? Amen, sir. It was the wonderful works of God. Amen. All nations shall flow under it. Yes, sir. And it's amazing. How that? You see, all nations gonna flow under it. He, he got them speaking in tongues. They speak in tongues, and all nations are there, and they, they, they all nations are hearing it. Amen. What was that? That's when the Holy Ghost was sent down. Yes, sir. Ain't that something? Amen. God is good. Isn't it? Yes, indeed. God do God do things we still can't figure it out. Mm -hmm. What did he say here? Amen. And they were all amazed and were in doubt. They were all amazed and in doubt. Saying one to another, What? What meaning is this? What mean is this? Others mock and said. Others mock and say. These men are full of new wine. Well, they talk these men drunk. They think they drunk. Go ahead. But Peter, but Peter, standing up with the eleven, standing up with the eleven, lifted up his voice, lifted up his voice, and said unto them, said to them, ye men of Ju Judea, Judea, of Judea, and all ye that dwell at Jerusalem, all that dwell at Jerusalem, be this known unto you, be this known unto you, and hearken to my word, and I want you to hear what I got to say. But these are not drunken; these are not drunken. And yet, as ye suppose, as you think they are, seeing it is but the third hour, seeing it is early in the day. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. See, it's still early. Yes, sir. Evidently, they were acting, must have been acting.
that kind of strain right. Yes, sir. Amen. Yeah, to the point they thought they were drunk. They thought they were drunk of new wine, but they drunk. Drunk of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Feel God's spirit. Yes, sir. A great things happen. You know, that's what you want to happen. You want great things to happen. I want God to fill people with this. Yeah. Hallelujah. Right? Amen. Hallelujah. It's going to be noise. Yes, it's going to be noise and brawl. Hallelujah. God. You know, there's so much. There was a bunch of noise there. Yes, sir. 120 people getting filled with the Holy Ghost. It was all kind of noise up in there. Amen. Amen. I'm talking about you getting filled with the Holy Ghost. Amen. I'm going to take it. You're going to be around here. Oh, glory. Amen. Um, no, it's a problem. That's just like you, you get, you think, you think, listen. If you get 20 women having babies all at the same time, think about what you got. It ain't going to be no silence in the room. No, sir. It's some new birth. Oh, glory. Has taken place. Yes, sir. It done brought joy. Yes, sir. Is that right? Hallelujah. That's what happened. Joy unspeakable. It was joy all the unspeakable. They was wondering, what is this? What's going on around here? I just gave you that illustration of 20 women having babies all at the same time. And all the babies were, wow. Is it going to be no? Yes. Yes, sir. Well, here's the new birth taking place. Ooh, hallelujah. Is that right? Jesus told me, they going back to Jerusalem and wait for the promise. Of a father which says me, you ever gone back to Jerusalem, gone be obedient, and gone back there. Is that right? Amen. And then went on back then. Yes, they did. And they was waiting. Waiting. Waiting at Jerusalem. Waiting. Hallelujah. Praying and waiting. Huh. Praying and waiting. Ooh. And then we wait. Because see, you say go back to Jerusalem for you've heard of me. He said, for the promise, he promised it to you. So all of you that are seeking the Holy Ghost here right now, God, remember, God promised it to you. It's, it's a, promise. a promise that he will give to you. You know, God ain't like man, but God promised it to you. He told, that's why he told him, go back to Jerusalem and wait, wait for the promise. Amen. Did he say so? Amen. Wait for the promise. And being assembled together with them, what he said, commanded them that they should not depart from now, Jerusalem. Don't you depart from Jerusalem. But wait for the promise of the Father. Glory to God. Don't leave. Yeah. Don't leave. Is that right? Don't leave your steadfast. Yeah. Don't leave your, your seeking. Don't leave that. Yeah. Continue to seek. Glory to God. Continue to wait for the promise. What yes, sir. What he said? Amen. But wait for the promise. Wait of the for the promise of the Father. Which said he. Yes. You have heard me. Yes. But John truly baptized with water. John truly baptized with water. But ye shall be baptized with the Holy Ghost. Mm. Not many days. Not many days here. It won't be long. Amen. Back, back over to the second chapter. Let's go with my back over to verse 14. Let's hear it. But Peter standing over the eleven, lifted up his voice and said unto them, said unto them Ye men of Judea. Ye men of Judea. And all ye that dwell at Jerusalem. And all ye that dwell at Jerusalem. Be known unto you. And hearken to, to my words. You and hearken to my words. But these are not drunken as you suppose. These are not drunk as you suppose. Seeing it is for the third hour of the day. Yes. But this is that which was spoken by the prophet Joel. This is that which was spoken by the prophet. All things must be fulfilled, which was written mm -hmm. in the law of Moses and in the prophets. In the Psalms. And in the Psalms concerning me. This is that what the prophet Joel had talked about. Yes, sir. What did Joel say? Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. And it shall come to pass. And it shall come to pass. In the last day, in the say last of God, day of God. I will pour out of my spirit. I want all out, flesh. I'll pour out of my spirit. Ain't that's all right. Thank you, Lord. That's the spirit everybody needs. Hallelujah. Not your own spirit. You need, need Jesus' spirit. Amen. Yes, sir. That's the right spirit. Oh, Lord. What else he says? Amen. I will pour out of my spirit upon all flesh. Yes. And your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Sons and daughters going to prophesy. Your young men shall see visions. Young men going to see visions. Your old men shall dream dreams. Old men are dreaming dreams. And on my servants and on my handmaids oh, I will pour out in those days I of my spirit. I will pour out in those days of my spirit. And they shall prophesy. And they shall prophesy. I will show wonders in the heaven above. Yes. And signs in the earth beneath. Yes. Blood and fire mm -hmm. and vapor of smoke. Yes. The sun shall be turned into darkness, and the moon into blood, before that great and hallelujah God, great and noble today, yeah. of the Lord come. Of the Lord come. 
And it shall come to pass. Yes. That whosoever yes. shall uh -huh. call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. And I tell you now what's going to happen. Prophesy all these things going to happen. Yes. Is that right? Young men shall dream, receive vision, old men yes, shall dream, dream, dream. Upon my handmaid, upon my servant, I will pour out of my spirit in the and they shall prophesy. One is that prophesying is telling of a coming event or something that has not yet come to pass. Yeah. Is that right? Amen. Who yes, can prophesy? Sir. A woman and a man can prophesy. Yes, sir. Is that all right? That's all right. Amen. But you know, you got to be in the, the spirit realm. You understand? Amen. Amen. You got to be where God is able to, to, to deal with you and to talk with you. And you'll be able to see and those things that God is wanting you to see. Hallelujah. Is that right? Amen. But one thing he, he probably he did probably with the Holy Ghost. Yes, sir. That's why he said he shall receive power. See, one thing about the Holy Ghost, I'm going to tell you something. You get God in, you see God, it's higher heights and deeper depths than God. Oh, Lord. Don't think we ain't we, we high as we can be. You know, you know how you can be so high up in there? Amen. We can be so high in the spirit of God to God can just deal with us in like little somebody. But it's a level that we got to get to. Oh, it's like, you know, I glory to God. I reminded of Jacob. Is that oh, right? I seen a lot of Jacob it. saw a ladder. You know, he the saw the angels ascending and descending upon the ladder. Yes, sir. Now, a ladder, it represents to me stair steps, you understand, of heights. Amen. You understand? But he saw, the, he saw the angels ascending and descending upon the ladder. Amen. Is that right? There's heights in God that all of us can reach. Right. Is that right? Amen. There's heights that everybody can reach. Amen. Is that right? But it's whether or not we put ourselves in a position to be able to reach the heights. There's so many distractions and so many things that now just take us away from trying to climb that ladder. Sure, you understand? They used to sing the song years ago, we are climbing Jacob's ladder. Then it said every round goes higher. Well, that's true enough. Because if you start out with a ladder, if you're standing on the ground and you put both feet on the oh, first step, you done got higher than you were. Oh, oh. Is that right? You ain't on the ground no more. No, sir. Then you go up a couple, two or three more, oh, oh. you're getting higher and higher. Is that right? You're you you elevating, you're getting yourself yes, elevated. Sir. Well, so it is with God, we get to the point of elevation. Amen. Is that right? We pray that God will help us to get elevated. And he dreamed. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. He was dreaming and saw these things. And behold, and behold, a ladder, a ladder. Amen. And what? And behold, Genesis the twenty-eighth child, uh -huh. verse twelve. Yes. And he dreamed, behold, a ladder set upon the earth. Yes. And the top of it reached to heaven. And the top, where it reached? Reached to heaven. The top of it. The top of it reached heaven. Amen. Is that all right? That's all right. The top of it reached heaven. Amen. Go ahead. And behold, behold, the angels of God ascending. He saw angels of God ascending. And descending on it. Ascending and descending. Yes, sir. On it. Mm. Hallelujah to God. Yes, sir. I'm reminded of Jacob. Jacob was, was so well and he said, this is not a dreadful place. Yeah, verse, amen. Ah, verse okay. 17. This is a dreadful place. Verse 16. And Jacob awake out of his sleep. Jacob wake out of his sleep. And he said, He said, Surely the Lord is in the this place. Surely the Lord is God. Hallelujah. The Lord is in this place. And I knew it not. I, I, I didn't know he was here, but I knew him. Yes, yeah, sir. The Lord is in this place. Don't you want God to be in this place? Amen. He was, amen. amen. You want God to be more. More to want heaven want to be elevated. Mm. What did he say here? And he was afraid. He was afraid. And said, say what? How dreadful is this place? How dreadful. See, I'm going to tell you something. People think, well, I want to see. It, it ain't that. <laughs> see, God just is a God. I don't want anybody to think, well, if I see, see God, you no. Know, God is able to help you. Yes. Is that right? But he just said, it's a dreadful place. And this thing, it's, it's something here. This is none other but this, the house of God. This is none other. I can feel his oh, presence. Glory. I can feel his presence. Lord Jesus. I heard somebody testifying how they was reaching after the Lord. Mm -hmm. He said, didn't he say, he said do that. Oh, amen. He said, reach. But you should happily, happily feel after him. Yes, sir. That was the scripture said now. Huh? Amen. amen. If you feel the presence of God, you can feel the presence of God. Amen. And if you feel the presence of God, you thank him. Yeah. 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 He ain't far from any of us. No, sir. Huh? 
Amen. You just, you just know it's him. Reach. How, how you know it's him? By faith. faith. Yes, sir. <laughs> faith. Yes, sir. Huh? Right. By faith. Reach out. Right. Never right. something right. things hope for evidence of things not seen. That's right. Is that right? Amen. That's why the scripture says, He that cometh to God must, must believe that he, he is. is. And he is. Huh? Yeah. Believe yeah. that he is. Yeah. Glory to God when you feel that yeah. power of God. Yeah. Glory yeah. to God. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And you know it's Him. And you yeah. feel His presence. You're going to reach out even more. Yeah. Huh? That's why Jacob says, It's a dreadful yeah. place. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He knew so much there. He said, I didn't even know this was the place. Mm. That I, this is none other but the house of God. none other but the house of God. And this is the gate of heaven. This is the what? This is the gate of heaven. Yes, sir. This is the gate. Yes, sir. Glory to God. The gate of heaven. Yes, sir. Huh? Ooh, it's yes, sir. It's all right. Yes, sir. Saints, it's high. It's high in God. Mm. Lord, help us all. It's high in God. Ooh, yes, sir. What is he saying, my beloved? Amen. Yes, sir. Back over in Acts, sir. Mm -hmm. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, sir. Back over to Acts, the second child. Yes. Amen. What was that? Verse 20. Let's hear it. The sun shall be dark. The sun shall be turned into darkness. Yes. And the moon into blood. Yes. Before that great and notable day of the Lord come. Notable day. Go ahead. And it shall come to pass. Yes. That whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Say what? And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Whosoever. 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 Whosoever go, let him come. Whosoever. Amen. You know what Jesus wants you to do? Call on Jesus. He wants you to call on Lord Jesus. Is that right? That's what he wants you to do. Yeah, he wants us to do. Hallelujah to God. Man, there ain't no strange thing. There should be no strange thing for us to call on Jesus. No. Who? Everybody. Because he said what? Whosoever. Who? Did he say so? Amen. That's what he said. That's what he said. Amen. That's what he wants us to do. Amen. Amen. Romans 10 and 12. What 10 and 12 say in Romans? For there is no difference between the Jew and the Greek. There ain't no difference between the Jew and the Greek. For the same Lord over all is rich unto all that, that call upon him. Rich unto all that call upon him. For whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord. Whosoever. Thank you, Jesus. You know what God does? <laughs> yes, he sir. recognizes. The name. Yes, sir. Honor the name. Honor the name. Yes, sir. Recognize the name. Hallelujah. It's like, you know, when people want your attention, they don't, if, they, if I'm calling Gwen, I don't call Sally. Jesus. I, I, she ain't gonna, you know, who's who, who, who that? That ain't her, that ain't her name. No, sir. So Jesus wants us mm -hmm. to call on the name. Yes, sir. That's why I say the name of the Lord is a strong God. Saints, friends, remember, call it. Jesus. It's important to call it. Lord Jesus. Young people, it's important to call it. Lord Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. It's important. They ain't saying, well, you want to. No, no. It's, I'm telling you what. Oh, I'm telling you the truth about this matter. That's true, sir. Is that right? Yes, sir. It's good to call upon him. Get ourselves to the point of, of out ourselves. And just elevate our minds and our heart towards Him. Yes, sir. Is that right? Oh, the enemy be coming. I don't know what the enemy. I come all kinds of. You need to stop calling. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody told you to call for the other brother, so you really got to call. So. That devil is a liar out of hell. Yes. The blood of Jesus is against him. Mm -hmm. The scripture says the devils know it's one God, and they, they tremble. tremble. Yes, sir. Yes. They tremble. At his name. They, they tremble. Yes, sir. Huh? I, I'm glad I got somebody named when the devil is trumping. Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Jesus. Sometimes you're in a situation. Jesus. You need to call on Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You can be home. You can be home by yourself. Jesus. And the devil Jesus. trying to get you to start thinking Jesus. Jesus. Start thinking Jesus. all kind of ways. Jesus. You got to call on one that the devil tremble at. Oh, yes. You got to believe he ain't, he ain't trouble. Oh, yes. Don't they do so? Oh, they do so. Now they trouble. The devil. Yes, sir. Hey, that's all right. Hallelujah. To God. That's a blessing, isn't it? Hallelujah. Go ahead, my beloved. Amen. Back over next, sir. I thank God. 
And it's going to pass that whosoever uh, shall call on the, the name of the Lord shall be saved. Shall Verse be 22. Saved. Whosoever does it. Go ahead. Ye men of Israel. Ye men of Israel. Hear these words of hear, Jesus of Nazareth. Hear these words. Of Jesus of Nazareth. A man approved of God. Well, he was a man approved of God among you. By miracles and wonders. He was and signs. Approved. He was approved not of men, but of God. He was approved of God among you. Amen. By miracles, by signs and wonders. Which God did by him. Which God, glory to God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Which God did by him. In the midst of you. He did it in, he did it in the midst of you all. He did it. Y'all seen it? Yes, sir. Y'all was there, yes, is sir. that right? Hallelujah. When he was raising the dead, healing the sick, feeding thousands. Is that right? Hallelujah. That's why he's talking like he is. Go ahead, my beloved. Yes, sir. Amen. Which God did by him in the midst of you. Yes, Lord. As ye yourselves also know. As you, you, all, you know. No, ain't like you don't know. Because you do know. Him. Listen. Listen now. Thank you, Lord Jesus. See. <laughs> He's going to tell them something here now. Is that right? He did all, he was a man, he was what? Approved of God. Yes, sir. By many signs and wonders, right? Amen. He was approved of God, not approved of man. See, that's what man, man won't, man won't, man's approved. But I'm going to tell you something, the best approval is of God. Because when God approves it, you're doing all right. Yes, sir. Because man may do it because he wants him some recognition, some glory. He might want him some glory. He might want him some fame. Lord. He might try to lift you up so you can praise him. Is that right? Amen. But this man was approved of God. Amen. Is that right? By yes. many signs, wonders, and miracles. And miracles. Read. Which God did by him. Which God him. did by him in the midst of you all. As ye yourselves also As know. As ye yourselves know. Him being delivered by the determined counsel. Him being delivered by by the determinate counsel and for knowledge of God and for knowledge of God ye have taken ye have taken and by wicked hands have crucified and slain and ye have crucified thank you Lord Jesus is that alright? yes sir the one that was approved of God approved did miracles and wonders in the sight and y'all are aware of it is that right? amen amen him what did he say? amen hmm Yes, sir. Him being delivered by the determined counsel for knowledge of God, ye have taken and by wicked hands have crucified well, the slain. By wicked hands, by wicked hands you have taken him and crucified him. Whom God had raised up. Wait a minute. Yes, sir. Whom God has raised up. You hear that? Mm -hmm. Whom God has raised up. You mean to tell me the one that you crucified, the one that you saw doing great miracles, but by wicked hands you wanted him crucified. Him, God, has raised up. Having loosed the pains of death. Having loosed the pains of death. Because it was not possible. It was not possible. That he should be holding of it. It wasn't even because he, he done a great marvelous works. Yes, sir. It wouldn't be possible that he should be that death. See, you know the last enemy is? The last enemy is death. Yes, sir. That's something that everybody got to face. Yes, sir. Whether you want to or not. Is that right? Amen. And the, 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 the raising up of Jesus made it possible that death can't hold you down. No, sir. If you're going to grave right. Yes, sir. If you're going to grave with the Lord Jesus. Death can't hold you down. Yeah. We used to set the song years ago. Can't no brain hold my body down. Because when we go down right, yes, go to rise right. right. We're going to rise right. That same spirit that raised up Jesus. Yeah. And that spirit that raised up Jesus blood in you. That's why you got to make sure you got the same spirit. He said also. He should also do what? Quicken your mortal your body. Mortal body by, by that spirit, spirit that the well you. in you. Yes, sir. That's what's so important. It's good to have the right spirit. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Is that right? Yes, sir. What did he say here? Yes, sir. Because it was not possible that he should be holding it. It wasn't possible that he should be holding of it. For David speaketh concerning him. Listen, David speaketh concerning him. I foresaw the Lord always before my face. I foresaw the Lord always. 
before my face. For he is on my right hand. He's on my right hand. That I should not be moved. That I should not be moved. Therefore did my heart rejoice. My heart rejoiced. And my tongue was glad. My tongue was glad. Moreover, also my flesh shall rest in hope. Is that right? Yes, that's right, sir. You got hope hmm. after this life. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Look for that blessing. Huh? Amen. You got hope after this life. Therefore, my flesh shall rest in hope. Amen. Because when a saint go, when they leave, their flesh is resting in hope. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yes. Amen. That, that's why you say, blessed are the, the dead that die in the Lord. Yes, sir. Is that right? When you live right and strive to do right, I'd be asking Lord, forgive me of anything I saw. No. Yes. Lord, Lord forgive me. Help me walk. Lord, Lord forgive us, Lord Jesus. Is that right? Forgive me, Lord. Lord, help me be like Jesus. It ain't in my heart to do wrong. No, sir. He brought me out of sin. Yes, sir. Is that right? Amen. Jesus. Because you want to be able to go down right so you can come on up right. Thank you, Jesus. What did he say here, my beloved? Amen. Amen. And my flesh shall rest in hope. Yes. Because thou wilt not leave my soul in hell. Would not leave my soul in hell. Neither would I suffer thy holy one to see corruption. Neither would you see suffer your holy one to see corruption. Thou hast made known to me the ways of life. Yes. Thou shalt make me full of joy with make thy me joy with that continent. Men and brethren. Men and brethren. Let me freely speak unto you of the patriarch David. Let me talk to you a little bit about David. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Because David was a man after God's heart, you know. Yes, sir. That will fulfill all of his will. Is that right? Hallelujah. Amen. But he promised something to David that he would call David or call to the flesh to right. sit on the ride and to sit on his throne. Who was he talking about? Jesus? What did you say? I, I, after that came down through all these generations, he was talking about Jesus, you understand? Wasn't talking about his son Solomon. Mm -hmm. But he was talking about Jesus because you got to remember Jesus came through the lineage of David. David. Yes, sir. You understand? Came through through that lineage, through that tribe, through that group, of, through that, through those people. Yes. Amen. That's why he say the lion and the tribe of Judah. The Lamb of God. The Lamb of God and the and the lion, lion of Judah, lion of Judah. Amen. Read, my beloved. Yes, sir. Because thou wilt not leave my soul in hell. Yes. Neither would I suffer thy holy one to see corruption. All right. Thou hast made known to me the ways of the made of life. Made known to me the ways of life. Thou shalt make me full of joy with yes. thy countenance. Yes. Men and brethren. Men and brethren. Let me freely speak unto you of the patriarch David. Let me talk about David in a little while. That he is both dead and buried. Well, David is both dead and buried. And his sepulture is with and us until this day. And his is with us until this day. Therefore, being a prophet. Listen. Therefore, being a prophet. And knowing that God has sworn. Knowing, glory to God. Knowing that God has sworn. With an oath to with him. With an oath to him. Listen. Knowing that glory to God. A prophet. Yes, sir. God was talking to us. What? Things that huh? came. He that saw. ain't came to pass yet, you understand? Mm -hmm. He spoke about Jesus through the law, through the prophet, and through the song. He said, knowing that he's a prophet. Yes, sir. What he said? Knowing that God has sworn with an oath to him. Sworn, God sworn with an oath to David. That of the fruit of his loins. That of the fruit of his loin. According to the flesh. According to to the flesh. He what would, he would do? He would rise up Christ to sit on his throne. He would raise up Christ. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord Jesus. This is dealing with the oh, lineage. Oh, yes, sir, indeed. Huh? Amen. Oh, God. Yes, he said he would raise up Christ oh, to sit Lord on Jesus. his throne. Yes, sir. Well, he would raise up Christ oh. to sit on whose throne? The throne of God. Yeah. What do you think Jesus is? He's sitting on the throne of God. Amen. Yes, sir. At the right hand. Amen. Oh, Stephen. Is that right? What else he said in my beloved? Holy God. Amen. According to the flesh, he will rise up Christ to sit on his he throne. He will raise up Christ to sit on his throne. He seen this before, speak of the resurrection of Christ. Oh, oh he yes. saw this before he spoke of the resurrection. He talked about the resurrection of Christ. Hallelujah. Go ahead. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Mm -hmm. That his soul was not left in hell. That his soul was not left in hell. Neither his flesh did see corruption. Neither his flesh saw corruption. This Jesus have God raised. This Jesus. Yes, sir. The one I'm talking to tell you Hallelujah. about. Hallelujah. The one that say that he swore with the Lord of David that he would raise up Christ Thank you, to Lord sit God. on his throne. This Jesus. Have God raised up. Have God raised up. Well, we are all. We are your witnesses of the things we saw. We ate, we drank with him. After he worked, the prophet, the apostles, telling the truth. Yes. 
It wasn't just talking. We got to know this teacher. We got to know the power of God. We got to know the presence of God. We got to know God enough to talk about it. Yeah. Enough to let people know. Yeah. I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I, ain't, I, ain't, I don't care what nobody else say. Right. I'm going to believe what the scriptures say. Believe what we have the scripture. Because people can say a lot of things, y'all. Right. People can sway you real quick. Yeah. Yeah. But we got to believe, yeah. gotta believe the scripture. Yeah. What do you say here, my beloved? Glory, glory, glory. Yes, sir. This Jesus have God raised up. This Jesus have God raised up. Have God raised up. Whereof we are we, we all are witnesses. We are all now remember now. This Peter talking on the day of Pentecost. Yes, sir, indeed. He talking on people that was gathered around thinking that they was drunk mm. with new wine. No, sir, they wasn't. Now you begin to preach the gospel to them. What is that? Yes, Go ahead, my beloved. Therefore, be by the right hand of God, being by the right hand of God, exalted, exalted, and having received of the Father, and having received of the Father the promise of the Holy Ghost, of the Holy Ghost, He has shed forth this. He has shed forth this. Hallelujah! What you but ye now, now see, see and hear? For David is not ascended unto the heavens. Oh, oh, but David ain't gone nowhere yet. Hallelujah, God. David ain't ascending into the heaven. No, sir. He's so you know he wasn't talking about David going. No, sir, he's not. Go ahead, my beloved. But he said himself. But he's David said himself. The Lord said unto my Lord. The Lord said unto my Lord. Sit thou on my right hand. The Lord said unto my Lord. And Jesus was David's Lord. Yes, sir. Is that right? The Lord God said unto his Lord Jesus, sit on my right hand. Until I make thy foes, that I make thy foes, thy footstool, thy footstool. Read. Yes, Therefore, let all the house of Israel and know. All assuredly. the house of Israel know assuredly. Hallelujah. That what? That God had made that same Jesus. God has made that same Jesus, whom ye have crucified. The one that you got rid of, God made. Now he talked about the lineage. He talked about the way he came from. Talked about the throne. He said, God has made that same Jesus whom ye have crucified. God has made that same Jesus whom ye have crucified. You know, when, the, when they saw Jesus go back in heaven, they said, that same Jesus that was taken up from you shall so come. That same Jesus. Is that right? Yes, that sir. That same Jesus, the Son of God was taken. That same Jesus, the Son of God coming back. Oh, yeah. What did he say here? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know certainly that God hath made that same Jesus, whom ye have crucified, both Lord. He hath made him both Lord and Christ. God made him Lord and Christ. And Christ, sir. Lord, God made him both Lord. Yes, sir. Uh, know ye the Lord. He's God. Holy, holy, holy. God made it. God made that same. God did. That's why in Philippians he said, he said that he had God, what for God has highly exalted him and given him and has given him a name which is above him. every name. That at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow. Huh? And things of can't get away from Jesus. Mm -hmm. right. No, sir. Things on earth, things in heaven, on everything. And on everything. Every time we were talking, we were Jesus talking Jesus. about how that he was saying, how that the angels worship him and everything worship him. Thousands and ten thousand and thousands of thousands. thousands. Same with him. I don't care how deep he is in the earth, mm -hmm. on the earth. I don't care if you're in the sea. I don't care where you're at. Everything got to recognize the Son of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Because God did it. Yes, he did. What else he say over there? Oh, yes, sir. Now when they heard this. Now when they heard this. They were pricked in their hearts. When they heard that, that God had made that same Jesus who we were crucified. God made him both Lord and Christ. Now when they heard this, what happened? They were pricked in their hearts. They were pricked in their hearts. And said it's a priest, Peter and the rest Peter of the apostles. And to the rest of the apostles. Men and brethren. Look okay, here, men and brethren. What shall we do? What shall we do? You know, we done, we, we see what we done done. I see what we done done. And I see what we done as man being worthy. And he was worthy. And God blessed him. And we crucified him by wicked hands. What shall we do now? Hallelujah. What shall we do? What did he say? Then Peter said unto them, then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sins. Repent. Repent, repent, repent. 
Repent and be baptized, every one of you. In the name. In the name of Jesus Christ. For the remission. For the remission of what? Sins. Of sin. And ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Amen. 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 Is that all right? You shall receive it. You repent, be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Oh, for the promise unto you and your children. That's why you've got to repent. And so all that are far off. Yes. As many as the Lord our God shall call. And with many other words that he testified in his own. Saying what? Save yourself from the to waste generation. They, they that gladly received his word. Were baptized. And they were added unto them. About 3,000 souls. Jesus. And they continued steadfastly in the apostles' doctrine. Yes. And fellowship. And breaking of bread and prayers. And fear came upon every soul. And, and, many, and signs were done by the apostles. Mm -hmm. And all that believed were together mm -hmm. and had all things, all things come. Get Acts 17, 24. Yes, sir. Still talking about repentance. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Acts 17, 24 says, Amen. God that made the world. God that made the world. And all things therein. And you see who made the world and all things therein? God that made the world. Go ahead. Seeing that he is Lord of heaven. He is Lord of heaven. In earth. And earth. Dwell not in temples made with hands. Dwell not in temples made with hands. Neither is worship with men's hands. See, God want to dwell. He ain't talking about just this, this, a building. No, sir. But you know, he want to dwell in you. Amen. You are the temple, are the temple of the Holy Ghost. He's the right. temple of God. That's why he wants you to repent of your sin. Amen. He don't want to just come to no temple any old kind of way. No, sir. He's doing all kind of things. No, sir. Going all kind of places. That's shaking right. around, bumping around, doing right. what you next. That's How God going to dwell in God God dwell in the temple not made with hand. Amen. God wants you to be holy. Amen. Holy. Oh, he Amen. want to dwell in a holy place. Amen. That's why you have to repent. Yeah. Yes, sir. And stop doing all the things that you Hallelujah. once Hallelujah. was doing and enjoyed doing. Yes, sir. Home mongering. Is that right? Preach. Yeah. Hopping around, doing Amen. this. Yeah. God wants you to repent of it. Talk about it, sir. All right, go ahead, my beloved. Neither is worship with men's hands. Neither is he worship with men's hands. As though he needed anything. As though he needed anything. Seeing he give to all life. Seeing that he give everybody life. Breath. Breath. And all things. Amen. He give you all that way. You thank him. Go ahead. Thank you, Lord Jesus. All right. And have made of one blood all nations. And have made of what? And have made of one blood all nations of, of men for to dwell on the face of the earth. All nations. Here we get. Here we are again. Dealing with all nations. All nations, John. Here we get back to all nations again, Amen. and one blood, one blood. Huh? Jesus, that one that shed his blood, shed his blood for the world. God so loved the world that He gave His Son. Yay. And it had not been the for the shedding of blood, there would be no remission. No sir. But because He shed His blood, and because He loved us. He shed his blood. Now we have a chance to be saved. Thank you for this chance, Lord Jesus. We can be saved. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Go ahead. What did he say? And have determined the times before appointed. Uh-huh. And the bounds of their habitation. And the bounds of their habitation. That they should seek the Lord. That they should seek the Lord. And if happily they might feel that they have. And happily they have fit, they seek the Lord. That's true, Lord. Amen. Seek the Lord. Jesus. Amen. God wants you to seek him. Jesus. Amen. You know, we see people in the world today, we seek everything else mm -hmm. but the Lord. Right. No. Amen. Yes, we do. We seek some everything. Right. Go ahead. Though he be not far from every one of us. No, he ain't far from you. Thank the Lord a long way. He close to you. Read. For in him we live. For in him we live. Thank God we're living. Go ahead. Ooh. We're moving. And have our being. We're living. We're moving. We have our being. As certain also of your own poets have said. What? For we are also his offspring. Uh -huh. For as much then as we are the offspring of God, we ought not to think that the Godhead is like unto gold or gold silver or, silver. or stone, it, graven by art and man's man's device. See, the thing is, it's like the Godhead is like these these, these materialistic things. Amen. Amen. They build itself up, and God ain't like that. Go ahead. What do you say? Amen. In the times of this ignorance. Well, the time when people were thinking that, they think that that was the way to go. In the time of this ignorance, what he did? God winked at. He winked at. But now commanded all men everywhere to repent. Commanded all men where? To repent. Call all men where? To repent. All men where? Everywhere. Everywhere to repent. Huh? 
commanding all men everywhere. Amen. Is that right? It don't matter where you're at. God wants you to repent. One nation. Is that right? Amen. Amen. Commanding all men everywhere to repent. Why? Amen. Because he appointed a day in the which he will judge the world in righteousness. He's going to judge the world in righteousness by who? That man. By that man. Whom he have ordained. Ordained. Whereof he have given assurance unto all men. He have, well, one thing about it, he got an assurance. Go ahead. And that he had raised him from the he, dead. He did what? And that he had raised him from the dead. He raised him from We have an assurance. Amen. Therefore, my flesh Amen. shall not see corruption, but shall rest in hope. Amen. Is that right? Amen. Amen. But he raised him from the dead. Raised him. He was the example of us. If we walk right, walk circumspect, and do what's right, we have a chance to be raised from the dead. And to be eternally and everlasting with Jesus. Amen. Second Peter three and verse eight. What it says. But beloved, be not ignorant of this one thing. Don't be ignorant of this one thing. That one day is with the Lord as a thousand years. One day with the Lord is as a thousand years. And a thousand years is one day. Uh-huh. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, as some men count slackness, but it's long suffering, it's long suffering to us word. Not willing that any shall perish. But that all shall come to repentance. Amen. And in his will that any should perish. Amen. God wants you to repent. Is that all right? Amen. Let's finish verse chapter verse 31. Amen. Whereof he gave him assurance unto all men, and that he had raised him from the dead. Uh-huh. And when they heard of the resurrection of yeah. the dead, uh -huh. so mocked. Uh-huh. And others said, We will hear the again now. Amen. 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 They said, you know what we want to do? We want to hear it again. The body expects every man everywhere to do what? Repent. What? Repent. Repent. Thank God he died for our sin. And we can have the right to be treated. And God bless you. And God keep you. Thank you, my friend. Amen. We thank God for you, man. All is very proud of people to repent of their sin. Be baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ. And we thank God for service because I'm going to do this for the time. And God will bless you and keep you. I hope you can see something that will be beneficial to you spiritually in the name of the Lord and give you more of a closer walk with the Lord. All right. Uh,